Oh yeah, we have some dope news. Let's go. <laughs> OB1 plays. Yes, right. What's up? Oh, All right. OB1 plays. is going on everybody how are y'all doing we have some dope 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 nintendo switch gaming news items for this video but first give it a huge thumbs up like 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 destroy that like button all right the first news item more details on metroid prime remastered coming to the nintendo switch this holiday season now has it been confirmed by nintendo but from a reliable source jeff grubb he's gotten numerous numerous um leaks spot on in the past but still take it with a grain of salt but at the same time get hyped all right so i'm um, already reported that the game is coming but here are the details according to jeff grubb it's coming november november 2022 this year november black friday right for the holiday season so this could potentially be nintendo's big holiday title all right this is what he's saying it's going to be updated with dual analog controls that's dope motion control support gyro aiming bro that's my dream come true a Metroid Prime game with gyro aiming, straight fire, improved visuals. Yes. This is Metroid Prime. The game already looks dope. It was, The GameCube, Metroid Prime on the GameCube was ahead of its time. And so the game is going to have even a more improved visuals for the Switch that is dope and so i'm hyped i'm hyped on improved visuals and improved performance come on it has to be 60 frames a shooter has to be 60 frames per second i don't care if it's not an online shooter but if it's a shooting game 60 frames per second would be ideal would be ideal and so hopefully hopefully the game can be optimized all right he also says the Retro Studios will likely implement new features to the Prime Remaster that will be incorporated into Metroid Prime 4 to get fans ready for Metroid Prime 4. So, the new features that are, they're incorporating in Prime 4, they're going to um, um, tag it over to this game to get us prepared, to get us prepared. Can't wait to see what these new features are, but I'm so hype so hype so hype so hype and so also the same studio that's making metroid prime 4 is making this remaster retros retro studios they have they're the studio that's worked on the prime series so um, i'm comfortable 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 hype for that so details 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 for huge metroid game coming this holiday season on the switch we just had the third party of nintendo direct of course nintendo is going to save games and, and announcements like this when they have a full nintendo direct i think we're going to get one this summer before the splatoon um demo comes out usually nintendo has a demo to come out before the game drops um I think it's a matter of time. Who knows? Finger crossed for July. We'll see. We're in July right now. Let's see. All right. This next news item. I thought this was pretty dope. In a recent um, Nintendo investor um, conference call, um, an investor directly asked Nintendo about F-Zero. Nintendo, when are we going to get a new F-Zero game? And... Uh, Nintendo's response was very interesting. This is um, two responses. 
from the general manager of Nintendo development team, Shinya Takahashi. He said, and I quote, We cannot tell you if there are any plans for future rem remakes of any specific game, but during development, we are always thinking about various possibilities that players can enjoy. He then proceeded to change the subject and started talking about Xenoblade and Splatoon. He said, hey, y'all focus on the games that are coming out right now. But, 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 that's not it. Also, also, um, Nintendo's um, president, global president, Shantoro Furukawa. This is what he said as well, um, pertaining to other IPs um, and old IPs coming to the Switch. In truth, it is difficult to fulfill all the requests we receive for new titles, remakes, or sequel in Nintendo series, he said. Um, that said, we are grateful to our fans and their patience in these matters. So, they pretty much said a whole lot of nothing. They just, they just said, you'll just get what we give you. Now, F-Zero is one game that we haven't had in a while another series that is so missing punch out bro every version of punch out has gotten better nes game was classic dope it improved on the arcade the super nintendo one improved on the nes the one on the wii improved on the super nintendo bro just give us for the time being Give us a remastered of this game, the Wii one. Bro, the Wii version was so lit, man. <sighs> I blame Xenoblade and Fire Emblem. It's because we keep getting these Xenoblade and Fire Emblem games that we're not getting any other games from Nintendo. <laughs> I'm trolling y'all. <laughs> oh, the internet gets so tight. Um, But, 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 all right. To end out this video, we're in the month of July. Two Nintendo Switch games on my radar in July that I think should be on your radar. First game is Live a Live. Live Alive. The game drops at the end of the month. I put it on your radar specifically July 22nd for Live Alive. And approximately a week later, the big boy for Nintendo for July is Xenoblade Chronicles 3 comes out july 29th so two dope games um coming to the switch in july it should be lit um that's it for this video man all right what do you guys think about everything we talked about sound off in the comment section below i want to know but before you go bro click that subscribe button stay up to date all things men 10 go we out this channel that i'm about to throw out there for you guys reminds me of me back when I had like 4,000, 5,000 subscribers, man. And um, he's probably gonna lose shit when I do this, but hey, man, I gotta say, my boy OB1, my boy OB1, man, that nigga is my nigga right there. He reminds me exactly of me when I was doing this shit on a smaller level. His channel, when I look at it, it's such a nostalgia trip. And he has a really cool audience too, man. If you could show this nigga some love too, that'd be awesome. I don't shout people out unless I like them a lot. A lot. I'm picky with that. But, um. Anyways, my boy Obi One, your boy Obi One. Hey man, I got you right here, my boy. Get that man a little bit of a look, man. He reminds me of me when I was smaller. You want to take a look in the past, my boy? This is the way you do it. I got you, Jedi homie. Master, the right Jedi Master. master. <laughs> we I got you, man. Obi -Wan. You're playing two towns. Thank you. I got Obi -Wan, you, man. homie. I'm dedicating a workout set. To you, my boy. Let's go, guys. Right? Four, twenty-five. 26, 27, 28. Ah, he said, hey, no, Dad.